first, ladies and gentlemen, on my left, fighting out of the blue corner, wearing blue trunks, and fighting out of and representing Houston, Texas in the United States. He weighed in at 17 stone, three and one quarter pounds, or 241 and one quarter U.S. pounds. His record stands at 39 wins, three losses, with 32 big wins coming by way of knockout. Ladies and gentlemen, he is currently ranked the number 17 heavyweight contender by the WBC. Here is the former USBA heavyweight champion, introducing Lou Stands at 47 wins, three losses, one no contest, with 41 wins coming by way of knockout. Ladies and gentlemen, here is the youngest man ever to win the heavyweight title, currently ranked the WBO number one contender, presenting the two-time heavyweight champion of the world. Ladies and gentlemen, he's back, introducing the one and only Iron Mike. The only thing I noticed is Frank Warren clap for Lou Savarese, and it's not clap for Mike Tyson. <laughs> no, I've been watching that. I've just been watching Frank Warren's action for the last two or three minutes there. Maybe secretly supporting Lou Savarese in this fight. Right, here we go then. The, uh, the meanest heavyweight of his generation, Mike Tyson, twice, of course, the heavyweight champion of the world, still on the comeback trail against Lou Savarese, as we will call him. The Italians behind us are pronouncing it Savarese, and that'll do for me, Frank. Um, Savarese, I believe, is the American pronunciation, but we won't worry about that. Referee John Coyle from Wolverhampton in the Midlands, and this one is scheduled for ten three-minute rounds. Don't expect it to last that long, do we? We don't, now we're ready. That bell's going to go, and the excitement's going to go right through this arena. And you, can hear the crowd now. you can hear the crowd really getting up this one. one. Here we go, then. Round one. Samaracy, of course, in the sky blue trunks. Um, he has the size to cause... Oh, oh there is the first no, he hasn't. There it is. First punch of the it's fight from over. Tyson. And poor old Samaracy's oh. flat on his back. Oh. One is up at about four, and he's in big, big trouble. It's all over shortly. Next punch. That was quicker than he put um, Julius Francis oh, down. Yeah. Oh, he's got to make. Oh, he's got to. It's all over. It's all over. Again. He's stopping it. He's finished. It's finished. It's finished. And the referee's trying to stop the fight. Yeah. Tyson's oh, still he's he's not he's referee down. Referee down. He's not the referee down. He's still trying to throw punches. Can't believe this. This is mayhem. And well, Tyson just over. realized it's all over. He's just realized it's all over. He Sam can't Reyes stop says, it. Hey, I'm okay. He can't stop this fight, the referees. Is he going to let it? No, it's, it's all over. It's all over. It's all over. So John Coyle ushers Poro loose Savarese to the corner. The fight is over. The crowd do not like that. They, well, they've come to see what is. Tyson, Tyson wants to fight on. Tyson was so intent Tyson on doing a job. On. Tyson was so intent on destroying Savarese, he didn't even comprehend the referee's instruction to stop boxing. He just kept on throwing punches, didn't he? It's, an, it's a bizarre finish, but you know it's what people pay to see. That's right. They pay to see. Where Mike Tyson is controversy. Got. It's funny, you know. Um, it's funny. Us. I mean, let's face it. Savarese was on his way to a good hiding. When John Coyle jumped in, he was hit and he was hurt. Now, you know, we always say, Frank, when a man's chance is patently gone, it's time to get in to save him from himself. Often. Um, but do you think that was a bit quick? I, I, John Cole's a good referee, he's not known for stopping fights quickly, but Savarese was on the ropes getting hit, he was getting battered, he recovered because of the confusion, the way they were trying to pull Tyson off when Tyson fell to the, f slipped there to the floor in between, That's right. um, you know, he would have been hurt if it continued, I mean, it's alright for all that, everyone sitting out here and everyone around saying, and the corner and saying he should be allowed to go on. But he had no answer to the power of but, Mike Tyson. Yeah, sure. But I suppose most of uh, most of our American viewers would be imagining that, that you know you had to nail Savarese to the floor to consider this one over. I mean, I don't subscribe to that personally. Oh, I, I think a referee. Had... Well, here we go again. 
and he was absolutely destroyed by the first punch that Tyson landed high on the head, bang Top down of the he head, went. right on the on the corner. And that's that's a very dangerous place to hit someone. That disorientates your whole body when you get hit there. Yeah. That's it again. And you said then, Frank, on the corner of his head. Yes. <laughs> what are you trying to say? <laughs> Pulled him right down the temple. <laughs> went across him. The first one. First punch. First punch called him. Well. Well. Let's just watch this again. Um, I think this was the follow-up, wasn't it? Oh no, it wasn't. No, that was a de that punch definitely landed on the head. Yeah, it landed there. That punch definitely landed on the head, didn't it? Um, watch again from this angle. Bang! Yes, the, the, the glove was actually further back. It didn't hit the glove at all. Um, some people might have thought it did, but it didn't. It actually caught him sort of on the on the uh, on the brow. Just watch. This is the best angle, in fact, I think, for it. Uh, this, this, oh, this is a bit later. Follow -up. This was no, the that is a good uppercut. Yeah. And he was that, hurt. Uppercut, that uppercut actually missed. Yeah. But that punch called him there. That body punch called him there. And now, that that's definitely the one. called him. He was him. on his way down, and wasn't he? That him. And, and that's when John Cord decided to get in. But I'm afraid John made a bit of a pig's ear of that, didn't he? Maybe the referee was a little bit too soon to he stop He should have grabbed Tyson and not Savarese. That's what he should have done. He should have grabbed Tyson instead. But he he should have let this fight go on a little bit longer, I do believe, now after seeing that. I mean, Savarese. Oh! Mind the referee got knocked out. John Cord hits the deck. He never could take a punch, John Coyle, could he? Well, you know what? This is done Julius Francis' stock very well. He lasted a yes. lot longer in this. Yes, he did, didn't he? Well, they're even almost having a conversation there, Tyson and Coyle. Well, it's interesting. Crocodile there is trying to call you out, Frank. He's having a go at you now. Bring Lewis on, he's saying. Bring Lewis on. Well, that's very interesting. Frank, are you going to respond to that? Get up there, Frank, and knock him out. Not really. I mean, I'm not here to, you know, I'm not here to here do go. Lennox lose. I'm, you know, here to report on this fight. Yep. Here we go. A bit of replay again from these final moments. John Coyle, they're taking a whack from Tyson, unintentionally, obviously, but uh, fascinating. And, and, you know, I, I do think John Coyle's made a mess of that, to be honest. Yeah, I think it's a bit premature. I mean, the crowd would like to see Savarese flat on his back being yeah. counted out. But, you know, the referee has a split second to... A split second to act. Yeah, that's right. A split we, second to act. We've got the benefit, of course, of replays. Um, but as you so rightly said, Frank, like in football, you know, if it, is it a penalty or isn't it a penalty? The referee has only got to see it once, you know, and he's got to make up his mind. Um, and that's what's happened here. John Coyle has feared for the safety of Savarese, so he stopped the fight. And, and, he's, and he's right to do that uh, if that's how he feels. But he, he actually did it the wrong way. He should have jumped on Tyson and not Savarese. Here's, here we go then, I think, for Jimmy Lennon to give us the official verdict. Um, it's a technical start, a technical knockout in favour, of course, of, of Mike Tyson. And we've just got a few seconds to go before the announcement. Ladies and gentlemen, we have the time of 38 seconds in round number one. A referee in charge, John Coyle, stops the contest. And the winner, Iron Mike Tyson. Well, who'd have thought that? 38 seconds, Frank. I mean, look at those eyes. That's an evil man of 